Yeah, no, we wouldn't uh, thank you. Like, you know, and so obviously it's uh, it's one uh, uh, one trophy, and we wanna we wanna win. We aim to win, you know, at the beginning of the season, and uh, that's job done. So you know, like, and, uh, and obviously we are getting to in, in Newcastle. So it's the first time then the, the club and us we we gonna hold it. So uh, no, it's it's always a, a nice feeling, you know, when you have got your hands on some silverware, you know. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, how do you take to this this game? This weekend, because you've you've won the league leader shield, but the ultimate aim is is to get promoted, and, and to do that, you need to have some momentum going into the the playoff bit, don't you? So, I mean, what's your what's your thoughts on the actual match itself this weekend? Oh no, you know, it's, it, like you say, it's it's a really important game for us, you know, and we treat every game and every position uh, the, the same. So, uh, you know. Uh, They've got some uh, some good players, Newcastle, who, with super league experience. When you look uh, across the the, the the park, you know, like so, uh, even an RL experience. So, uh, um, so that you know, like they came up from League One and they they, they did well to uh, to maintain themselves there, you know. And so, so we're gonna go there, you know. And uh, for, like we, we we will approach this game like with uh, like we did with the other games and uh, very seriously. And we need, like you say, it's our last game before the semis, and uh, so it's very really important to uh, you know to make sure that like, we um, we we work on our on our all our details, and then we you know we, you get a lot of confidence before before the playoff games. And uh, I think last week the RFL confirmed this. It all depends on on COVID, but it looks like the semi final at last, Sylvan, will be a home game. Uh, I mean, what, what does uh, how what does that mean uh, to the squad? You feel ahead of that that semi final? Oh, it's huge. You know, we um, like we haven't played uh, one game, one home game all season. You know, and uh, and, and obviously it's uh, you know that's why that's why you play rugby. You know, to play in front of your fans, your 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 club, your your family. You know, and uh, your your sponsors. And so now we. We really missed it, you know. It's been a, it's been a long, long time. So uh, we really pleased, and uh, and the RFA confirmed that, and, uh, you know, and and then now, then we finally it's gonna it's gonna come true, you know. It's a, obviously the stadium and the, the pitch is in a great knit, so it's it's gonna be tremendous, you know. And we can wait. I know that the club will obviously work really hard now to to make sure we uh, we, we fill up that that, that stadium. It's, it's quite big, but at least you know, we have like a, as many supporters than we can, and. Uh, uh, and and they're doing a great job there, and so uh, no, it'll be, I think it'll be a tremendous day, and uh, um, and hopefully there'll be some more, you know, after. <laughs> well, um, Sylvan, ahead of the the semi finals, uh, just a, a final thought really on on this weekend's match against Newcastle. You're getting uh, silverware, and you know, pretty historic stuff as well, because it's not just Toulouse who've won their league leader shield. Catalan Dragons have as well. Um, France have announced that the the twenty twenty five World Cup. I mean, it's it's all great stuff, isn't it? If you're a followers of the French game, that's for sure. Yeah, yeah. As you say, you know, like it is it's incredible. You know what's what's uh, at the moment. You know, both club did and uh, and with like the, the French version, what they're trying to do. You know, it's a. Uh, yeah, I think it's, it, there's a good mood, you know. Like I, we can see that the, the rugby league in France is, is on is on the right um, end of this, this this vicious circle a bit, you know. So, so now it's and that's why we need to make sure like we we finish the job and we can transform it, you know, as I can into a, a you know some positive and making sure and then the games grow in France and 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 probably will make it will help and and it will, it will help to grow the, the game in Europe and. Uh, and be more competitive, you know, in 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 the world. After at the end of the day, so no, it's, I think we need to jump on board. We, but at the end of the day, after it's going to come down to to, to us doing the job, the Catalan finishing finishing uh, what they've done too, you know, and um, and us making sure we get a promotion, and um, and then probably like you know after after on the back of that France, probably can in the French Federation can do you know like it'd be fantastic to have a, a good results against England, you know. And, at the end of the October too, if that friendly happen, you know, and and I think it could be like a really good, uh, uh, really good, really good, some good positivity there from uh, from the, the French rugby.